Hi guys! So today I am going to be showing you um, some things that I picked up from Ulta and Target in my little haul shopping trip that I did. Um, there were some things that I needed to pick up but then there were some other things that um, I thought were pretty cool and I just wanted to pick them up to try them out. So I'm excited to be showing you guys. So um, I'm going to start with my Target. So from Target. So the first thing that I picked up here was this e.l.f. blush brush. I wanted to try to use this um, for my setting powder under my eye area. I just wanted to get a different brush for that. I've been going back and forth trying a lot of different brushes and I just wanted to try this one so I picked this up. The next thing that I picked up was this Purpose uh, Gentle Cleansing Wash and I have been using this for quite some time now, um, at least the past couple of months, and my I'm out of my other bottles, so I had to pick up another one. This stuff is really, really good uh, face wash. Um, it's super gentle, and I think it does a really good job. It helps, you know, with my, because I have really sensitive skin, and I have acne problems, and this stuff really works, so I picked that up. The next thing I got here was these Kiss um, active oval um, nails here. These are glue on nails and I just wanted to kind of just try them out. I've been um, wanting to do something different with my nails and I saw these there and I think it was like five bucks so I just picked these up and I wanted to try them out. So I have those and then the last thing that I got from Target was uh, this sweater here and this is really really cute it's a long uh, sweater and I thought the design on it with the flowers and stuff was really cute I don't know I just couldn't I I saw it and I couldn't pass I couldn't pass it up so I had to get it so I thought that was really cute moving on to my Ulta stuff here the first thing that I got here was another one of my um, Revlon Colorburst Lacquer Balms and this one is in the shade Demure 105 and I had this um, recommended to me by Beauty by, Mrs. Beauty by Mrs. Outlaw and she recommended me to go and get this one and it is what I'm wearing on my lips right now. Um, I really like this color. Um, it's something that I probably wouldn't have picked out originally but it is really really pretty. It's got kind of like a sparkle to it, but it's not like a frost. Let's see if I can focus there. It's not like a frost, so it's not like, as you can see, it's not frosty. It doesn't look childish and frosty. It's just this really pretty pink color. Um, that picked up the tip of it there it's just a really really pretty pink color and it just goes on so smooth and buttery I just love these I'm so so in love with these um, lacquer balms and uh, matte balms right now from Revlon the next thing that I got was another can of my Batiste uh, dry shampoo and this is the brown um, dry shampoo I love this stuff and I am almost out in my other can, so I had to pick up myself another bottle. The next thing that I got here was these little Revlon um, eyeshadows. And these are little individual eyeshadows. They come apart. I was messing with them and I pulled them apart. And I took the stickers off because when you go to peel the packaging off so that way you can um, attach them together you have to take off the little stickers so I believe this one was called plum and this one I can't remember the name of it but it's this one here is like it would be really good for like a highlight color um, can't really see it on there but it's a sparkly white color and then this one here is the plum color and it's a pretty plum purpley color. Swatch this one here again. See if I can swatch it. 
and I wanted to try those out. I wanted to try out this purple color because I really didn't have anything um, that I could really compare that to with it being like a matte plum color. So uh, I picked that up. I thought that would be really pretty. Uh, the next thing that I got here was the Bare Minerals Mineral Veil. And this is just a like a translucent powder. And I have the Bare Minerals well rested for my under eyes and I've really really been liking it so I wanted to pick up some other Bare Minerals products because I used to use them like way back in the day and I kind of strayed away from them and then um, now I'm kind of going back so that was when they did like the subscription where they would automatically send you another subscription in the mail and that's kind of why I quit using them so I have that again and then the next thing I got here was the Garnier Olea hair color and this is a permanent hair color this is in the shade medium golden brown uh, this is how I dye my hair before I used to dye my hair I used to get it professionally done but recently I've been just kind of coloring my own hair and I needed to do that again here recently because my roots are growing out and you can see all of my gray hairs it's terrible <laughs> so I picked up another box of this and I'm gonna be coloring my hair pretty soon so you can see what that looks like this stuff is really really nice uh, this hair color. I've tried a lot of different hair color products and this is this is by far been one of my favorite. The last thing that I got at Ulta was the, and I spoiled myself, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz Pencil. I have been wanting to try this out for a long time and I finally was like, you know what, I have a coupon, I'm gonna buy it. So yeah, I got it. So this is what it looks like. It's just this really skinny little pencil here. And on one end it has the spoolie, little tiny spoolie. And then on the other end here it's a super fine um, eyebrow pencil. It's like super tiny. So I am super excited to try this out on my brows. I haven't found something that I actually liked using on my brows, so I'm hoping that this is something that I'll really like. So yeah, I'm super excited. My first Anastasia uh, product here, so pretty excited. And then that pretty much does it for my Ulta haul and my Target haul. The last thing I just kind of wanted to show you guys was something that I purchased online. Um, there was a girl that I met through Instagram, and she has her own hair brush or her own makeup brush line. And so I bought some makeup brushes from her that I wanted to review. And I have them here. It's so cute. They came in this pink. She sent it in a pink envelope here. And I just need to open this. And there's the packaging. Really cute. Okay. And these makeup brushes are called Girly Girl by Iris Jerry. That that is her name. Let's see if I can get that picked up there on the camera. From everything I've heard on Instagram from other makeup artists, these are really nice makeup brushes. And so I wanted to um, give them a test myself and see how I like them. There's five brushes total that come in the kit and it's $38 and it was well, $38 and then there's $5 shipping um, she did have a sale she has sales going on a lot of times so um, I'm gonna put her information down in the down bar um, like her um, her Instagram username so that way you can go and check it out because she does sales a lot and so when I bought these I had been watching it for a while and she kind of went down in price and then there was some days that she was doing like free shipping and stuff like that and so um, I took advantage of one of the days when she did the free shipping so that was pretty cool $38 for five makeup brushes and so I did that and so they actually they're super soft oh my goodness Wow, these are really, really soft. So I'm going to open this one up here. It's a really nice brush. It's so, so soft. I'm not sure if these are... 
I'm not sure if they're synthetic or not. I think I'll have to ask her. I didn't even think of asking her. So that pretty much does it for my haul video for you guys today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. I'll show you guys um, some new products that I picked up and I'm going to be trying and some products that I've been using and I just needed to pick up like a refill. So yeah, that pretty much wraps it up for today. So I hope you guys enjoyed and yeah, I will be seeing you guys in my next video. And until next time, bye guys.